going on guys welcome back to the channel critical overlord here so the runtime for it chapter 2 has been revealed it's clocking in at about three hours almost just as long as avengers endgame just as long as the movie that came out a few months ago or last month from ari aster midsummer is just as long or just about as long as that movie was um in my opinion that's not a bad thing whatsoever i think that that's very good and interesting because what that means to me is that uh the approach to this film then was to include as much from the novel hopefully as possible and try to stay true to that narrative because if it was around an hour and 30 something minutes or an hour and 20 minutes or anything less than two hours i would have been a bit skeptical about even expecting that much from the movie not to say that it would end up being a big a big bad show at the end of the day but if they're going to be eliminating and it's going to have that short of a runtime, that tells me that they've excluded a lot of things from the novel and they're kind of just doing their own thing here. So I think the runtime is warranted for the content that's in the book. I am looking forward to the movie. Uh, two hours and 45 minutes isn't really that long. It is longer than Midsommar, yes. Uh, it's, it's not as long as Endgame, but it's just about. Um, I'm I'm just really excited to see how they're going to wrap it all up. I haven't read the novel in many years. The it novel many years Stephen King has praised the sequel so far I haven't heard any complaints about it uh, director Andres Muschietti he gave comments on the runtime he's the one that revealed this he said that those who have seen it they didn't have any issues with the film's pacing they thought it was warranted so if everything is gonna be as positive as what he's saying it is from the general public when it actually has its first screening and when critics start seeing it and stuff and when the masses finally get to see it I think that we'll all be in for probably one of the best two hours and 45 minute films to date uh i can't imagine them actually dropping the ball here i just i just don't see it. the trailers look too good uh that doesn't mean that we we are going to get a good film if the movie is bad i'm going to tell you it's bad and where it fell where it failed at uh but i just don't see them making this and completely bombing it i just don't i don't see it the trailers look too good they have an amazing cast from top to bottom almost uh i'm really excited to see what happens how it all unfolds Again, I haven't read the novel in several years, so I'm a little bit... I don't really recall who all is going to die, so I'm going to try to avoid any spoilers. Even then, if I do read the spoilers, they might switch it up a bit for the movie. But again, I'm looking forward to It Chapter 2. I'm glad it's over two hours, almost three hours. I think that's warranted for the content, and it's enough time to get caught up with the characters, enough time to present some information on the character of Pennywise, probably give a little bit about the backstory, maybe even a mention of that turtle. I hope they don't mention it. Um, <laughs> But I'm looking forward to the movie, and it's coming out in just a few short months, a few short weeks, actually, because it's almost August, so it'll be here pretty shortly. Uh, let me know what you guys think about the runtime down in the comment section below. Are you excited about this? I'm pretty sure we've all seen movies longer than this if you've seen Michael Bay's Transformers films uh, or anything like the Titanic. But let me know what you guys think about the runtime down in the comment section below. Are you excited for it? Chapter 2. If you haven't already, make sure you subscribe or turn on post notifications so you never miss a video. In the description, I'll have links on my social media accounts, on my Facebook, Twitter, and Instagram. You can message me there to let me know if there's any movies, news, or reviews you would like me to cover in the future. With all that in mind, guys, I will see you in the next video.